Bro, it's people out there that swear they can tell when somebody is African or Black American. Bro, you can't tell. You literally can't tell, bro. Most of the people that be saying that they can, you know, differentiate between Africans and Black Americans are the people from the North, bro, or the Midwest. If you go down South, especially Southeast Coast, bro, you not going to be able to tell, bro. Go go to the Southeast Coast. Uh, go to Alabama, um, Georgia, Florida, South Carolina, certain parts of North Carolina. You not going to be able to tell, bro. Literally. You ain't going to be able to tell the difference. Even certain parts of Louisiana, bro. You ain't going to be able to tell. Then, then on top of that, it be people out here saying, oh, black Americans, most black Americans are just brown skin or light skin, bro. What? What? That's how, I, that's how I know, like, you don't live in the South, bro. Like, people that be saying that don't live in the South, bro. You can't. You can't live in the South. You can't. Like, if you saying that, you can't live there. Because the majority of people in the South are either dark skin or brown skin. Bro, bro, I literally went several days without seeing a light-skinned person down here. Several days. Dog. Like, do you know how, like, I work, I travel every single day, hours. Every single day. I see hundreds and hundreds of people every day. I don't sit in no office, bro. Bro. So that that lets you know that if I seen nothing but dark skinned people and and brown skinned people, bro, for several days, there's a lot of dark skinned and brown skinned people in the South. On top of that, bro, the dark skinned people down here, some of them be dark as Senegalese people, bro. For real. You know, and I, I haven't been down here in a long time. So I kind of, I kind of forgot myself that like black Americans can get that dark, you know what I'm saying? I forgot, you know, even though I have grandparents that are that that dark, you know, as Senegalese people and Sudanese people, you know what I'm saying? But being up north for so long, bro, you kind of like, you know, don't see that often unless you're seeing like an African or uh, a Haitian or something, you know what I'm saying? But when you go down south, you're going you gonna to really see some real African-looking people. And I would say, I would like to say the only way y'all can really tell the difference between the two is the mannerisms, right? But what's starting to happen is Africans are moving over here more and more every single year. And they assimilating into black culture to the point where y'all ain't going to be able to know who who's who. Because now they got our mannerisms. How you going to tell? How you going to be able to tell, bro? Like, I, bro, my grandma, bro, she has, uh, she had more African features than some Africans that I knew, that I know. But my grandma was 100% African, though. You know what I'm saying? Not from the continent, you know. Um, My great-grandma was 100% as well you know, on down the line. Um, but anyway, yeah, you're not gonna be able to tell. 